weighed up certain pros and coins for aiding such a show. And target market was the first important factor. With a population of 6 million potential viewers, there were plenty of changes for the activity to happen in England, and yet the number was quite approachable and manageable. Another factor to decide for the producers was what funds raised by the Marato would be allocated and from the beginning, there were channels towards biomedical research into incredible illnesses. The decision to deal with a different disease each year was galvanized by the commitment to serve society as a whole and to invest in a universal collective future in order to reach the greatest number of people and involve influence and benefit the population in the most democratic way possible. On the other hand, another important consideration was that Spanish and Catalan citizens did, the, did not have a full raising culture. For this reason, it was very important to specify where the money rice would be allocated and how it would be utilized. Transfer, transparency, since day one, was one of the pillars of La Marato to ensure its success and gain the truth of, the, of a society that was not used to making donations. So important was transparency that in 1996, its foundation was at Seattle. The foundation of La Marato was created as the custodian and administrator of public donations with the mission to encourage and promote biomedical research Built on a passion to serve the community, objective decision making, rigor, efficiency, and transparency. The foundation is the main link between the public and the television program and forms the basis of maintaining truth amongst the stakeholders involved. And I want to explain what's the Lamar do. This is a charity project driven to the three and its foundation with the goal to obtain financial resources for scientific research on illnesses that do not have a known cure 
an informed society of this disease. But La Marato for Catalan citizens is something more. And I want to explain it with a short handmade video. Where else is La Marato Philippines? more than 15 million US dollars. This is some of the news in our newspapers. And the foundation declared that this number represents a historical amount because La Marato has become the telephone which has raised more money per capita on an international scale. And the keys of its success 
of this event mainly comes from the wish to serve the society in the best and most diverse possible, rigorously, responsibly, and transparently. However, it's important to stand out. It is crucial to mention TV3's role in this development due to that this channel is seen as being rigorous, transparent, unbiased, and trustworthy. Another key is the feeling of attachment. Besides being one of the fundamental values of TV3, it can also be found in a marketing campaigns carried out by the Marato, in the involvement of the many Catalan groups, in the drive of biomedical research in Catalonia, in the management of its own foundation, and in so many small gestures and actions that have enabled La Marató to grow within the region. And the mainstream publicity and the exponents by La Marató conceived for the whole of Catalonia have given rise to the entire population getting involved in the event to extend that they have made it the attitude of the citizens, the way the public has established and consolidated shared initiatives as one of the essential and elements of La Marató, says a lot about the country's values. Experience has shown that for the people of Catalonia, being involved in La Marató is not a temporary decision, but an attitude, an act of personal and collective conviction. And finally, this is the area of Catalonia. The character of the Catalan society, deeply marked by historical evolution, has given rise to this action, taking root to form a part of the country's identity. Every year, La Marató represents a challenge for the country. It is a demonstration of the values of a society that wants to show the world it is compassionate, mature, and committed. And this article, which is mostly based on the opinions and experiences of several people linked to this act, is just one of the many points of view illustrating the power of this event. It is each person's experience and excitement that is the real power behind each charitable act. La Marató now belongs to every Catalan citizen, the result of hard work and creating momentum, raising awareness and the authentic desire of the Catalan public television network to provide a service to, uh, for the entire society. And that's all. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Maria. <coughs> Does anybody want to ask any questions, or we can have a I, I, the floor for discussion? I, I have a question, and my uh, question comes down to each year uh, they raise money for different charities. Mm -hmm. uh, in, in what method do they make the decision on which charity? The, La, the foundation of La Marató has a, a big group of um, doctors or people who know what is the most important illness or the most important um, illness that I need some help? And they decide each year, beginning of the year, uh, which will be the next uh, visit. 